What did you mean by that, Mia? She slept with Zaire. Where were you that night? Nigga, you know where she was at. Don't play stupid. I spent the night with Zaire. Ah, shit. Did you fuck him? <laughs> yes. Oh, I'm doing you! Hey, hey, hold on, this shit ain't funny. It ain't funny, but it is. Hey, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another video. Hey, if you new, make sure you leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, turn on your post notifications so you don't miss a video. Now, as you can see, man, well, first, you can tell by the setup. I got the mic. I got the mic uh, placement a little different. You know what I'm saying? I, I, got, I got my mic stand right here. I was recently going to buy a, uh, a mic stand off Amazon at first, but then I was like, you know what? I remember I had a mic stand in my in my closet because I remember like cause I told you I do music. I do music. Probably like six, seven years ago I had my own studio, like at this building or whatever. And and we had I had like a whole bunch of studio equipment, whatever the case may be. So fast forward, um as you can see I'm here now, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I took I took some of the equipment with me because you know, again I make music. So and I was struggling with the cause like this is the original. This is the this is the original. Um like the mic thing right here but this mic this is the original mic holder right here but i told myself i'm like you know what don't i have a like like i need a mic stand bro because i feel like a couple of my videos i feel like i couldn't y'all couldn't really hear me i feel like i sounded too low so i was like nah it, it gotta be a uh it gotta be a way i can like i can like you know what i'm saying i need like a mic stand or something i need one now i remember like wait i got a whole mic stand in my closet boom set it up as you can see so we here now anyways man you see the title man this is this is one of the movies where like i like this is one of the movies that's i feel like up there with acrimony and I haven't even seen Acrimony, and I and I'm, I'm but I'm gonna watch that too because I haven't seen it. And I'm gonna watch that because a lot of people on Twitter kind of debated, like, oh, Taraji, Taraji was in the right, but then the bro was in the right. I seen a lot of people, and you know I'm saying I know I know a little bit of it. I know I know how the story goes a little bit, but um, but this movie, a couple of people already seen it. A couple of my friends and already they already seen it. And they was like, when you gonna watch it, bro? Cause we can't talk about it. You ain't watched it. Y'all was like, you know what? But I'm gonna watch it. Yeah, what is it? Mia Copa? Mia Cooper? I, I, is, that, is that how you pronounce it? Yeah, so we gonna watch that today. Kelly Rowland. Oh my God. That, she, she has never missed a day. That woman is beautiful, gorgeous, outstanding, astonishing. Mm, mm, mm. And I also seen a uh, bro from, um, what was he played on? Moonlight and Bird Box. I was like those, I think those are the only two movies I've seen him play in. I feel like there's more movies I've seen him in, but I just can't think of it off the top right now. But we gonna get into this movie, man. Um, if you enjoy, it, if you end up liking this reaction, make sure you like the video, comment down below what you want to see next, share and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more of me, and uh, hit that Patreon link if you want to see the full reaction to this video. So without further ado, man, let's get into this movie. Tyler Perry Studios. I ain't gonna lie, at this point, Tyler Perry is just about uh, BET, considering all his shows be on there. Would you like to share with us your feelings about what Cal said? And that's where he goes when I ask him the hard question. No, I'm sorry. I'm your husband. Does Jenna know that? Does your mother know that? Does she know that? <sighs> Look, I'm, I'm sorry. I know we only have 20 minutes left, but it's my mom's birthday. She's pretty Guy, big go and sit down somewhere. And look, don't get me wrong. I look, look, I feel like any, any, any son, daughter, any any child loves their mother. They're gonna love their mother regardless. You know what I'm saying? Cause like when you're single or you're dating someone, like so like you're not married, pretty much. Like when you're unmarried, but I feel like single or a relationship, your mother, you know, I feel like your parents comes first. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of people that feel like their family comes first, their parents comes first, their mom, dad, whoever, right? But there are some people, including me, you know. Feel like once you get married, your wife comes first, or your your husband comes first. You know what I'm saying? Because you, because now you're building a new foundation, you're starting a new chapter in your life, or you, you know what I'm saying? You're building your own family. You know what I'm saying? I feel like though they come first. You know what I'm saying? Again, but your 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 mother, your family by default is like they always gonna you know what I'm saying? They gonna come first. You know what I'm saying? They, well, they're gonna come first, but your wife or your husband or whatever they come first first. You know what I'm saying? But y'all get y'all get what I'm trying to say, but. Y'all, but that's, I just want to throw that out there. Y'all, y'all get it though, but I just wanted to throw that out there real quick. Maddie. Oh, <laughs> Mia, hi. 
Have you met Jair Kel- Mahal? Bro, Kelly Rowland really looks so good. She like, she yeah. looked, bro, like it's fine one. She previous. hasn't aged a day. The queen has finally arrived. Don't worry, son. Your second wife will be on time. <laughs> Get ready to put your dukes up, because it's tea and shade coming behind mm-hmm. Oh, what? What? No happy birthday for the old lady? I mean, I know why my son liked her so much. I mean, I wish she were my daughter-in-law. Damn. <laughs> you see, Jenna? What a sweet boy he is. He's always been so sweet. <laughs> Those two aren't doing so well. <laughs> bro, well, I, don't nah, bro. I don't like that, bro. I don't. One thing I would never want to go through me or my wife to go through is like the whole battle with the moms and shit. Dads don't do that. Dad's going to say how it is. Like, 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 like with a husband, like with the husband and the wife's father, the dad's going to tell like it is like, look, I feel like you like, I don't think you're a good fit for my daughter. I feel like you uh, like, they going to tell like it is the mom, the mom, see mom's going to throw shade at the wife. I, they're not doing so well. Well, see, uh, maybe your second wife will show up on time. Like, Oh, son, you sure know how to pick them. And, or like, she's like, oh, well, she wasn't my first option. Actually, I thought that you would do better with this one. But, hey, it's your decision. Like, bro, the, like, they literally shade, bro, the, the mom would shade the wife every chance she get. Where, the or like, the dad would tell the husband straight up, hey, I don't fuck with you for real. But, hey, but, hey, like, it's my daughter's decision. Whatever, like, and, and, like, whatever she wants to do, if, she, if she's happy, I'm happy. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to tell you like this. If you hurt her or whatever... Like, like this, this is gonna be your last day breathing. Like I'm telling, like, like, like the dad gonna tell her husband how it is, whereas the mom is, is gonna shade the wife every chance she gets. You know what a catch he is. Hey, okay, come on. You just had to outdo your older brother, huh? Come on. Oh. Now open ours. <laughs> oh, you okay? And on top of that, hold up, pause, pause. I know it's his mom's birthday or whatever the fuck it is, bro. Nah, fuck that. What the fuck makes you think that? Yeah, I want to sit down and talk to my homegirl or whatever, but I also want to sit next to my husband. Like, I know it's your day, it's your birthday, you want to sit... Because, look, you, cause look, she's sitting at the head of the table. Cool. She's the mom, it's her birthday, cool, right? One son's sitting on one side, the other son's sitting on the other side. Cool. Why is this chick that he's not even with sitting next to him while Kelly is sitting at the end of the table with her friend? Which is cool, but, like, why is she sitting at the end of the table? It should have been the mom in the in the, in the at, at the head, Kelly's Kelly's uh husband, Kelly Rowland, Kelly's friend, and whoever the the fuck uh, this new chick is. She 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 could have sat at the end, or she could have sat next to the older brother, because I don't really see nobody sitting next to the older brother. The older brother looked like he's sitting on the on the other side of the table by himself. What did I miss down there? <laughs> we were just talking about how lovely this is for your birthday. I bet you were. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, the mom, the mom doing too much, bro. Yeah, nah, the mom, bro. The mom, yeah, bro. I don't, I don't like their mom, bro. I don't like their mom, bro. She really, she really had, she really had the wives. I feel like I, I was gonna, I wasn't gonna say it. I was really biting my tongue and holding my tongue to say it, but nah, fuck that. The mom, low key, kind of racist, bro. She had the light skinned girl sitting next to her, like next to Kelly's again, Kelly's husband. You got you got both the, the dark skinned, beautiful dark skinned, beautiful black dark skinned women sitting at the at the very end. You got the light, bright people sitting at up front. You know, I'm not trying to be racist, but that's but that's what that's what it seemed like to me. That's what that's what they give it to me. Now on top of that, why she not if if if, if the black chick supposed to be the older brother husband, why is she not sitting next to him? We could always move to the city. Yeah, you know Ray loves the countryside. Mm. I love you, boys. Who is mm. well, who is this chick supposed to be? Y'all remember on um, and I hate if it, man. Look, I'm sorry if I keep pausing the movie, man. If you don't like it, hey, just 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 keep going, bro. Just 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 just, just, just skip over it, cause I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep talking my shit regardless. Yeah, y'all remember that part on on Think Like a Man too? Remember when when when, when Terrence Jay's character he, he, like told his mom off because the way the mom was treating Candace. And a lot of people was uh, saying like he was wrong for the way he talked to his mom. Even though like yeah, she disrespected your wife. You shouldn't talk to your mom that way. And it's true. He like it's true. He I I feel like he had to like he had. To. But the thing is, bro, the, the whole movie, the whole movie, bro, the mom was low key kind of shading Candace every every chance she got. Like Terrence J was like, I'm tired of it. Like I'm tired of you. Like you know what I'm saying. Like you going like this is my wife. Like you gotta respect. Because the thing is, is Candace even said like, no, you gotta go apologize to your mom because if if my son would have said the like, did what you did to your mother, uh, I wouldn't know how to live with myself. I would I would feel devastated. Point I'm making is is that I feel like this nigga, 
Kelly Rowland's husband, this nigga should fucking like talk talk to his mom for real. Cause he sees that his mom is disrespecting Kelly, but it's like he not saying shit. And it's like, bro, I I'll tell my mom, like, yo, stop, stop doing that. Stop it. I love you, but stop doing that. How much was it? I sold the piano. Oh shit. You stopped years ago and it was just sat there collecting dust. But but you and it was mine bro. in the first place. So yours and mine now is So his mom is dying. It's sad. I'm gonna just. I'm. Gonna, I'm not gonna make a long pause. It's sad, but still, bro, you can't be disrespecting my wife. And another thing, people need to stop doing. Young folk, old folk, whoever. Just because you're dying, bro, it sucks that you're dying. But just because you're about to die or you're going through this life changing event where you feel like you're not gonna be here anymore, that doesn't give you the right to disrespect people, dog. That doesn't give you the right to disrespect people. Not getting you like if you want to go out with a bang because you feel like oh at the, hey, at the end like hey they're not gonna do nothing to me anyways because I'm gonna die I'm gonna be dead but still that doesn't give you the right to disrespect people bro that's because bro that's not funny and it's not fair. Zaire Malloy is in your office. What? Why? Everyone was staring at him out here, so I put him in your office. Uh, he was supposed to call. Should I push your? He must be the, no, uh, no, the, the, the black long. dude from Moonlight and Bird Box. Oh, he is. I did not kill my girlfriend. This is my life, and they're trying to ruin me. So this kind of like a who done it situation, almost. It's like a like a suspenseful who done it, romance, uh, scandal type of movie. That's what it's giving right now, and I don't like saying it's giving, but that's that's what they're showing me. The DA has appointed your case to the assistant DA, who is my brother in law. Brother in law, and I assume you love your husband. <laughs> what? Imagine if your husband, because they're all lies. Our firm has a retainer of seven. It doesn't matter. I want you. I'll take a look at what the prosecution has and I'll get back to you. Man, bro, Kelly looks so good. I'll let bro. you know. Oh, Ooh, speaking of cold. No. Don't do it. Hi. I'm getting ice cream right after the gym is crazy. You feel better now? That was real quick. What the fuck? Is it free? That shit had to be free because she walked to that motherfucker for like legit two seconds and walked back. That shit had to be free. Between you and I, Ray is loving this. He wants me to represent him. What? Don't do it. I hate that I have to keep pausing it, bro. But it's just a lot, bro. It's just a lot that I'm seeing right now. The fact that, for one, he's a black man being accused of killing his girlfriend, harming his girlfriend. And look at the generation we live in today, bro. Look at the generation we live in today. And as a black man myself, bro... So it ain't, bro, it ain't easy, bro. It's not easy being a black man, bro, like in America or just in, in life in general, bro. It was it was already hard before the, before the world got the way it was, but now it's, it's, it's worse, my nigga. Especially like with the way social media is now, bro. I'm telling you, if some shit come out about you, as a, for like for a black man, any black man that's watching this, if some, shit can, if some shit can come out about you right now, bro, and before the truth or the real shit can come out, motherfuckers already canceling you, they calling you out, they calling you weird, they calling you weak, they calling you a bitch, nigga, they calling you, they, nigga, they canceling you, nigga, you, you losing deals, motherfuckers coming at your head top, nigga, niggas is ready to just, just, motherfuckers ready to just cancel you out, and it's like, the worst part is, it'll take forever for the truth to come out, sometimes, sometimes. Sometimes the truth can come out like, you know what I'm saying, within a month or two months, three months, whatever, you know what I'm saying? If, if the truth spin, spin the block, like, quickly, and motherfuckers find out what happened, then the whole the narrative is going to switch to where it's like, okay, but he still, like, did that. He still, like, you know, or, like, or like well, it shouldn't have happened. Or motherfuckers going to go quiet. The disrespect and the canceling was loud when they, when they thought you did it. But then when the article came out, found out that you didn't do it, and this actually happened, she the one that did the shit and whatever. Nigga. It's, it's silence, nigga. It's silence. Because them same motherfuckers that counted you out are quiet because they don't want to look stupid trying to backpedal and be on your side when they found out you didn't do the shit. I, I'm just thinking about it. See? Look at this. And another thing, hold on. Another thing. Damn, nigga. And another thing, motherfuckers will send death threats and everything. Motherfuckers will come out and say shit like, oh, and give him the needle. Ain't nobody gonna take that serious. Ain't, that's, ain't nobody gonna take that serious. Why would this nigga scare her like that, though? I defend murderers all the time, hence defense attorney. Not against my brother. It's not happening. Okay, where was this energy at for your moms, though, my nigga? Pick one. 
Tell me which one you will pay and then tell me what you're not going to let me do. <clears throat> the house note. And you don't want me to tell them that you lost your job. Ugh, go on, say it. Well, he lost his job, you they don't know. Gone, so don't tell me what I will or will not do. I know that's right. Nigga, you ain't paid a bill in a, in a yeah, good minute. Pick one. You, ain't trying to, hey, pick one, nigga. Bro, she ain't hit. She ain't trying to hear that shit, nigga. Just pick one to keep it pushing. Okay, exactly, nigga. Move the fuck along, nigga. Trying to tell me what I'm not finna do, and then you ain't you ain't paid a bill in a in a good ass Mr. minute, Malone, nigga. Get the fuck out my face. Ooh. Where have I heard this song before? Cause I heard it multiple times. These skull fragments were found in one of your paintings. Her skull, her hair, her DNA. I'm willing to bet. Obviously, he didn't do it, but I, it, it, I, I wonder. Would have been hanging know. in the fragments of her skull. Stop. Why? Why do you keep? Why stop saying that? Why do you keep saying that? The prosecution is going to say it. Yeah. A lot. Yeah. They they gonna try to say whatever they can How to you get you to get under your skin. Ah, oh, honey, you have got to get more than takeout in this house. Look at how my boy is thinning. See the sun. I feel like he doing this shit on purpose, bro. You're insulting my cooking. Mia, come on. You know what? I'm running for mayor. That's great. And he's gonna win. I'm sure. She don't give a fuck. Same old, same old. And nah, I, I feel like he knows something because this nigga, this nigga looking at her weird and shit. I am considering ripping Zaire Malloy. No, you're not. <laughs> Excuse me? You will not represent him. I hadn't made a decision. No. Hold up. You have. We have. Pause, 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 pause all the way. Hold on. Oh, no. Nah. See, at, for the rest of this movie, I'm on Kelly's side. I don't give a fuck what happens. I'm, I'm, I'm on Kelly's side for the rest of the movie. If she make a mistake, fuck it. We all make mistakes, but I'm on, I'm on her side for the rest of the movie. I don't give a fuck what happens. First of all, you don't pay none of my bills in the house. You don't. Dude, you can't do what I do. You might, y'all might have some pull and have have connections and shit. But what you not finna do is tell me what I can't do and do on my job and who who I can and can't represent. That's what you are not finna tell me. You are not finna tell me what I can do with my job. You are not finna tell me that. That's number one. Number two, you not even. You might be head of the family, but you are not head of the house. That's number two. And number three, she don't even know her son lost his job. She don't know that Kelly been covering the bills. She don't know that Kelly been covering like everything. I'm pretty sure been cooking too. I'm pretty sure. You not finna sit up and tell me why can't oh I like oh oh like you're a family now. We have a say like like bitch. First of all, no, not even fourth of all, you're not my mama. You're my uh mother in law. But that don't mean I gotta do what you say. The fuck? Cause I have a voice of my own and I have a choice of my own. I am not bitch, no. And I don't wanna and I don't wanna call her a bitch. I'm sorry, but it's like, bro, she's bro. Uh, she's doing too much, bro. And it, it's it's like, bro, I get it. She she's dying, bro. But they don't got a clue in the fucking world. Again, that don't give you the right to act like like like, like a like 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 a mean ass person, like an asshole. I'm sorry, but that don't give you the right to act the way you acting, bro. And look at Kelly's face, bro. Look at Kelly's face, bro. I would gave her that same look. The fuck, are you talking about? You're not representing him. You gonna pay me? You, you gonna give me the money? I wasn't sure if I would represent him. But now I am. Tell me I don't have an answer. Get the they fuck out of here. Like they were going to find out, and you know how it gets around here when they're mad. And she's sick, so I just. They need to stop using her being yeah. sick as an excuse, okay. bro. Oh. They, they dragging her at this point. Uh, thank you. Hey. Oh my uh, God. Uh, bro, well, they got everybody in this doing? movie, bro. That's Cal. Uh, is he still lying to his folks about losing his job? Why do I feel like if and when the mom finds out that her son lost his job, I feel like she's gonna blame the mom is gonna blame Kelly. Like, well, you should have, you should have tried harder. You should have got him. Like, 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 she, like. It, it, I feel like she's gonna try to blame him for it. I mean, blame her for it. Like, she's gonna blame Kelly for like, oh, it's your, it's your fault. He lost the job because of the, uh, you know. I feel like I, I, that's what I think is gonna happen. You know, I could be wrong. This is your sister in law. She knew I was prosecuting the case just to antagonize my brother. Who has done everything for her? Ah, uh, what do you know? That, but the crazy thing is, it ain't got it ain't got shit to do with her brother. I mean, his brother. I didn't do anything to her. Well, you did something to her. Hmm? Sex, right? 
This mean that was your girl, bruh. He liked to pull my hair and make me gag. Jesus, spit on me. Hey. Pleasure. Deep was never deep enough for him. If I didn't show pleasure on my face, hey yo, what the fuck? Do that was her thing. Why are you smiling about it? Cause it's funny. Nigga. She was. She just was. She would choke me, bite me, pour eye candle wax on me. It was a game. I had eye candle it. wax is That's crazy. Cool man, you got a lot of women after you, don't you? Well, you know, sometimes it's like that. Okay, the arrogant motherfucker too. <laughs> I like it though. Done some wild shit, but I've never heard nobody. I'm type of man loves to see pleasure on my woman's face, not mm. pain. Pleasure. I like that. Yeah, I'm really just waiting for them to like form a connection and smash. Ain't gonna lie, Mexico look well. This side of Mexico looks beautiful. <clears throat> No good morning or nothing. Do everything we can get back there. I know you can't answer that. I know. I mean, I believe y'all can. All me. Yeah. I promise I'm going to do everything to get us back there. Cap. <laughs> I'm sorry. I really am. I love you with everything. You should want to do better right now, dog. If you ask me, bro, when, when two people see their relationship is like failing or isn't going how it used to go, and it's like every time y'all see each other, it's like y'all just hate each other. Y'all y'all arguing every like five minutes and shit. At some point, there has to be a common ground where it's like, bro, we, we need to stop arguing and like figure this out. Because I love you too much to argue with you, fight with you. And every time I see you, it's an issue. Like, bro, I love you too much for that, man. Like, and I want to I wanna fix this. But because it's really on him, yeah, he needs to fix it. Because you could, you, you could tell she loves this man. You could tell that, you know, you could tell that she... Like still wants to keep trying and, and wants to you basically all in all you can tell she want to be with this man but it's like he's making he's making every and giving her every reason to just say you know what at some point I'm gonna just give up man I'm gonna you know and ask for a divorce because they don't because they don't have any kids I think it's just like he needs to like get his shit together you know what I'm saying and because they ain't even really disclosed what type of job he had or like or like or like yeah like they haven't disclosed the type of job he had and and how he lost it but. Right now, because you're not working. I don't know what it is he does during during his free time, but it's like, big dog, I need you to, like, show that you want this marriage, nigga. Show that you want to, you know what I'm saying? Because you're just letting a lot of shit just fly by and letting shit slide. Like, come on, bro. I need you to be the man, nigga. Like, be the man and be in demand. It may sound arrogant, but I know what I want and I know what I don't. Sometimes it's everything and everyone. I remember bringing one of my paintings to her. After going to everyone in the city, is she noticing like 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 the white on his beard serious. or something, or like or or the or like what's going on? She got furious, wanted to control me. You can relate. Yeah, my life is in your hands. Do you want to die of lethal injection? Oh my god! I am your attorney. I am not your friend. Yet. I don't want to charge my cause anymore. Boy, so he's all alone, bro. So she know what that's like. He feels alone mentally, physically, emotionally. She feels the same way, bro. She can't I relate. I got married. I'm married. Sit down. Sit down. Sit. <laughs> okay, nigga. Just you know, at go. one point, I wanted to Thank be like an artist slash painter. That's that. I'm going to miss my train. I live in Chesterton. Come on, I'll take you to the station. I thought she said you couldn't leave your house. He can dress though, I give him that. The brother can dress. I thought you had a car. I do, this is faster. That does not seem appropriate. You always do what's appropriate. <laughs> Come on, man, just ride right side side. That does not seem safe. You always do what's safe. D bro. My ride is pulling up right about oh, now. Okay. No, no. Thank you. Yeah, I didn't. Damn. For a second, they had me thinking it was they was actually going to hop on that bike, bro. Yeah, they had us the first half. I'm not going to lie. Question it. Just let it go. Yeah. She, yeah, she was feeling that. Too. She was feeling it. Oh, my God. Oh. I hope I hope that wasn't that first position. I hope like he lasted longer than that. Cause if that was if that's all he can give her, that's that's a shame, bro. That's a shame. 
Bro, you supposed to have her feeling like that. Why you acting like that? Ain't no way in hell. She was probably thinking about him. Like about thinking about bro while while her husband was smashing her. You got people that do that. They'll think about somebody else while they're smashing the person they smashing. You left so early this morning, I didn't get a chance. I Thank you. I have a lot to do. Okay. That's the first step. First step. Look, I was thinking, uh, how about dinner tonight? I, was, I knew it. Therapy. I knew it. Okay. Yo, wait. Wait. Yeah. Look at this nigga. Must be your husband. Zaire. Nah. Yeah, there's no need for the introduction. Bro, that's wow. crazy. My what happened to me in my loft? I thought it would be better if we meet here instead. Just to stay focused. So let's go to my office to discuss the gallery owner. Stay focused. You know, the cops nah, she I thought that was witnesses. the whole reason for meeting my place in the first place. Not for real. Well, this is better. Because we got witnesses better. and it's daylight. Niggas in suits and I'm, I don't feel, I can't open up here. Meet me at my loft. So much better. Are you taking this seriously? Are you? I was just going to say, are you? Like... Mr. Malloy, are you really leaving? By the way, uh, see them jeans. This nigga's stupid. Mr. Malloy. Hello, it's me. This nigga it's know what he doing, bro. I got to give it to him. That nigga, got, that nigga cold with it. He know what he doing. Doesn't last too long. Maybe I should Nah, they gotta smash this time, bro Cause she did This is like, the third time she came to this spot They have to smash now Or yet. kiss or no something I find you Incredibly attractive You turn me on when I see you at least, at least he's honest about it I hug you when I see you Because I love the way you feel The way you smell Your brilliance Very attractive you can tell she liked that shit because she could have stopped him at any moment, but she didn't. Zaire Malloy, an arrogant murderer. Zaire Malloy killed his girlfriend so his paintings would go up in value. That's what you think of me. Doesn't matter what I think. It's what the jury thinks. So I tell you that I'm attracted to you and you start throwing all this bullshit in my face. Everything in your body says you're attracted to me, but you want to admit it to yourself or to me. Yes, sir! This nigga's spitting. That's true. New lawyer. Your trial is in a month, and that'll be hard for any attorney to get up to speed in such short time. Admit it. You find me attractive. That is a lie. Stop the cap. <laughs> Stop the cap right now. Stop the cap. You have my life in your hands, and you can't admit a simple truth to me. Mr. Malloy, I can smell the marijuana. I know that you're high. It's not helping. Well, being high brings truth. Maybe you should try it. Yeah, listen. That's called motherfucking bars, nigga. Fucking you know nothing about that. That's a fact. Where are you going? I need to dance. I'm going out. Mr. Malloy, you cannot be seen in public. Dancing. Where I'm going isn't public. Get your shit. Let's go. Damn, nigga. I see how your breathing change when I look at you. I'm trying to play cool. Play big girl. I see you, big girl. <laughs> you shouldn't be. I told you I'm not going out. Hey, where are you going? We so say you're going to dance, but like, where are you finna dance at? In the garage? Unless there's like an underground club or something, then okay. Okay, there's no way she, she that far behind. Oh my, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, it's like a sex house. What the hell is going on? Dog, what's going on? Oh my god, you wanna fuck? I got X. Huh? That nigga say, You wanna fuck? All right, okay, come on then. And the you fact that this man is go. playing the game with her is crazy. But it, 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 hold up, is this all he does all day? Sayer <laughs> told me he want another lawyer. Yes, please talk to him. He doesn't want me to. Don't give up on him. He needs you. Okay, now they have to smash because, like, she. this is the fourth time at this man's house. And they went upstairs. I know this is hard for you. Yes. I wanted to say that first. My marriage has issues, as do most, but we will work it out. But you won't find anyone better or anyone who cares as much. That's a fact. Uh, call me tomorrow if you want me to represent you. I mean, I mean, I mean, you're here right now. Why would I? 
Well, I gotta wait to call you tomorrow. Oh, oh, oh wait. Hi. What I'm the Siri. fuck? What the fuck? I'm a big star. Yo, that transition got my ass. Dog, what's going on? This nigga is getting the sloppy toppy, my nigga. I ain't gonna lie, I would have felt mad uncomfortable though if I was if I was Kelly, bro, in that situation. That motherfucker not working. This nigga is a menace. Okay, I ain't gonna lie. Can we can we change the scene now? I'm getting I'm getting uncomfortable now. I ain't gonna lie. This nigga, bro, this nigga's a hoe. I had a feeling like, I, I bet you got a button he can hit for the elevator to work. Cause she was, mother didn't want to work. It's been a long day. What's wrong? Is this about Cal and that girl? What are you talking about? Oh shit. Check your phone. Oh shit. Hey, no, I, I, I am sorry, kid. Okay, but they're at the Winston, room 714. Are you there? I say get confirmation first to see if he's cheating before you just decide to go sleep with uh uh Zaire. I feel like she should go go to the go to the um hotel first, get confirmation to see if he is cheating, and then you can do what you gotta do after that. I'll call you back. I'll call you back. Please, Mia, just take a breath, okay? I'll be by my phone. Cause he gave him the address and the room number. Bro, are they still going? And she went back. Oh yeah, they about to smash now, bro. But the other girl gotta go though. I don't want her being part of that. I say shower first and then like, you know what I'm saying? Um, bro, I would have showered first. I'm sorry. I would have showered first. That's just that's just me. <sighs> yeah, well, bro, um, imagine if a man didn't cheat though. Imagine that. But what reason would you need to go to a hotel room for like this late at night with a girl that your mom trying to set you up with? I'm trying to get like you, my boy. Hey, I'm loving every bit of this. I'm sorry. I'm loving body paint, nigga. Okay. Unravel me. Unravel me. Oh my. Oh my. Hey, I'd rather see hers than his, but okay. Uh, yeah, this song going on the playlist. I'm sorry. Niggas <laughs> fucked in some paint. <laughs> That's hard. It's abstraction. Man, it's beautiful, though. I always saw myself with a woman like you. Honestly. Hey, you gotta clean it off, man. I always saw myself with someone spontaneous. It makes love to me the way I want to be made love to. Mm. Someone like... Me? Me. Exactly, nigga. It's a bad way to meet her earlier. Where will we be? Somewhere in love. In the Dominican Republic. I'm, a, I'm about to say, she somewhere off the beach, one of those you, villas. Exactly. Well, like it's good. I'll do my best. What about the husband? Though? Well, she he, he cheating, so it don't Tell matter. Tell me, we'll go when you get me off. We'll go when I get you off. It's just if she, I wish she wasn't with her her husband now, bro. It just sucks because now it's like you can tell she seems more in love and shit, and more like you know what I'm saying. What the fuck? Where have you been? Excuse been me? me? All night. Yeah, I don't like this. Neither do I, Cal. I don't like this at all. Your voice. Nigga, keep your mother. Hey, she's Hold right. on now. Oh, hey. First of all, don't be loud talking to me in my an establishment. No, nigga. No, no, nigga. No, nigga. No. 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 Because she ain't even really talking to you crazy for you to even get to get rowdy with her for real number one and number two nigga like like she said nigga we in my office nigga my domain nigga, we in nigga we in my sanctuary that's keeping our other sanctuary not even our my other sanctuary lights on nigga me and my me we in my main domain sanctuary that's keeping my other domain lights on at the crib nigga watch how you talk to me nigga watch how you talk to me don't like bro <laughs> nigga, bro cal let's go to the winston Azalea said she was feeling very bad, so we moved her into the Winston so that she can be closer to the hospital since we're so far out. What room? Oh, so now you want to know. You keep talking, man, and you shut the fuck up, huh? 714. 
that the same room that uh no hold on was that the same room that that, that her friend told her because i think he said 117 she, they, they, she they just really said 7 14. i thought we were doing better please tell me what's going on she's kind of preoccupied with some real nigga dick <laughs> Now, hold up, pause. Let me go back real fast. Cause I could have sworn bro said room 117. Okay, so my bad. Okay, my bad. Never mind, never mind, never mind. Okay, I had to be sure. I had to be sure. I spoke to Jason Timsdale. I spoke to him this morning. He has an excellent team. Stop. And they are ready to take you on. He's conflicted now. You're feeling guilty. You're embarrassed. You want to avoid me. I get it. Do you want to gamble with your life? Oh, now you feel about me? Absolutely. <laughs> What's more important to me right now is how I feel about my husband. Don't cap. Let's not cap about that. Uh-oh. C-A-P. Flag on the play. Mia, please. It's too late. You know I need you. You know I need you. Yeah, you ain't lying. Please. I can't believe I did it, Jimmy. She's human. Okay. Well, she was in there because she was sick. They were all in there. Ray and Charlize, too. I shouldn't have said anything. It's not your fault. Like nah, you okay. a real nigga. You had to tell her. God. I'm not giving it him. You can do this. It ain't your fault. You don't don't, don't blame yourself. Y'all right? shouldn't blame yourselves. You just talk. The reason she said that she was willing to talk to you. If you still feel like you can't, then you drop. I legit thought they was on the boat the whole time. Shut the fuck up. I'm surprised they're not rushing the door right now. Can go to <laughs> <laughs> are you gonna stand there or are you gonna come have a seat i was trying to see like what was about to happen because like she walked around her and she's just standing there so i'm just like what's going on you fucking him yet she sucks i beg your pardon i beg your pardon and he has a real sizable package, like the snake that he is. Bruh, what the you fuck wanted is... to talk. And as soon as things started going well for him, it was bye-bye, old broad. Understand how that kind of betrayal can feel. You can't understand nothing. You're not even 50. Damn! I'm sorry. I told him I was angry with my ex, and he sat me down in front of an easel and made me paint. Wait a minute. He said, close your eyes and tell me what color you feel. So the same thing he did with her. So I, blue. Blue, yeah, figured. And he made me paint waves. waves. Then he asked me, are you angry? Are you angry? Yeah. Word for word, Shit. bar for bar. So there I was with this canvas of blue waves and red lines. Hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. And you know what he did? He finished it. Oh, the painting. And okay. he put it on the canopy over the bed. I looked up and there was my face. Oh, okay. Bigger than life. So the same thing he did with her. I was the canvas that he played with until it was done. Wait, did you smash Many. it too? Now that little laugh in the background of the music is crazy. Oh my god, bro. Damn. I haven't felt relaxed like this in a long time. I didn't hear that. It's multiple ones? Ain't no way is that Have many layered like that there's no way so you take down the painting of me painted that die bitch you ruined my life and put it back up start the elevator yeah just start, start the elevator it. if you are talking about telling my husband i will tell him I know what i'm saying what are you saying just that i love you you are so full of shit Nah, see, it's more to this story, bro. Like, it's something we—it's it's something we not seeing, bro. Start the fucking elevator. Mm -hmm. Start the fucking elevator. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, her acting is, bro. Acting is. 
immaculate, bro. What's going on? Cal? Come here. There's a mama right there, so she didn't pass on. Something about Jenna? No, nigga. No. Callan, I need to tell you I something. Wouldn't, I wouldn't have said nothing. I would have waited you to see what they were supposed to over an hour on a drive here. Couldn't tell him then? Yeah, but I would have waited. I would have waited to see what he was going to say first. Whatever you to say, he'd say to all of us. Nigga, shut your ass down. Cal, please. He's not talking to you. Cal. What did I say? Nigga, uh, hold on. Nah, just... Bro, nah, bro. See, nah, bro. Y'all finna stop. Nah, that's why I said. That's why I say. I don't give a fuck what Kelly does. The rest of the movie, I'm on her side. I don't care, bro. Because these niggas, this, this is a piece of shit ass family. These niggas feel like because they got, seem like they got money and power. For, you know what I'm saying? These motherfuckers feel like because they got money and power, they can treat people and talk to people any kind of way. Like, bro, I don't give a fuck how much money you got. I don't give a fuck how much power you got. I don't give a fuck who you are, bro. You're not finna talk to me any kind of way. Like, you're not finna talk to me crazy. You're not finna talk to me stupid. My nigga, we can really, like, shoot the fade for real, my nigga. Like, bro, you got, bro. <laughs> Ooh, if this was, if this was fucking Destiny Child's Kelly Rowland, like the old Kelly Rowland, oh, she would have clocked all their asses, bro. Every last one of them. Side note, first of all, Future Retro Hill, what's good, y'all? Side note, I just wanted to state that her friend was not a real friend as well. Her friend was not, she was never a real friend to her throughout the entirety of the movie. Her friend was not a real friend. She was allowing Kelly to get disrespected like ambushed, like 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 ganged up. She like she she allowed Kelly to get disrespected every chance that she got. And she sat there and did nothing but say Like bitch What? What are you what are you talking about? You you are the only other black woman in this room besides me. And you and you see how they treating us, how they treating me. How they talking to me crazy? And you gonna sit here and say, Okay, guys, let's just calm down. Let's take a beat. Let's just relax. Let's and then once you get to the end of the video, or, by, or for the ones that seen the movie, once you get to the, like, I guess close to the end of the movie, you'll see why I said her friend's not a real friend. Because you'll, you'll see why. You'll see why. Even while I was editing this, I realized her friend was not a real friend. I just want to state that. And the friend ain't doing shit. Calm down. You shut up. No. Bitch! Nobody needs to calm down. I am mad as hell. After all that my son has done for you, you buy these expensive suits and he has to work overtime just to pay for them. It's insane. He don't got a clue in the fucking world. And they still don't know he lost his job. Tell him. And be honest. They still don't know he lost honest. his job. Is that what we're doing? Nah, for real. Cause we can really- we can, we I lost can my job. What? Yeah, exactly. She's been supporting me the whole time. Exactly. Fuck is you talking about? Talk shit now, and nigga. I'm in rehab. Talk shit now, bro. Bro, talk your bro. Talk shit now, nigga. Keep that same energy you was giving Kelly to this nigga, bro. Fuck out of here, bro. I'm sorry, bro. Again, I'm sorry if I'm loud, bro. My boy, hey, hey, man. They've been dragging. They, they've been dragging Kelly the whole movie, bro. Y'all finna stop it, bro. Y'all finna stop. He said, honesty. You want You want to go there? I'm about to say because because if, if you want to talk about honesty, let's lay let's lay out all the cards right now, and then the mom gonna have the audacity to say, "Bitch, you don't even you don't even know what's up for real. I'm the breadwinner. This nigga ain't got no fucking job, and he in rehab, my nigga. Yeah. <laughs> the, ooh, bro. What are you saying? It's all her fault." What, see what? Too much pressure see, on you. see what she I say? She doesn't deserve you. What I say? You know, I they gonna blame her because of an inappropriate relationship with your client. See, I knew. I, knew that? I knew the mom was gonna blame her. Oh, it's your, it's, it's her fault. What did you mean by that, mean? She slept with Zaire. Where were you that night? You, nigga, you, nigga, you know where she was at. Don't play stupid. That's me. I was Zaire. Ah, shit. <laughs> did you fuck? Him? You need to leave. I'm I'm sorry. It's <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's just his, his reaction. <laughs> 
I'm sorry. <laughs> Hey, hold on, this shit ain't funny. It ain't funny, but it is. Okay, all right, <laughs> all right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's just his 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 reaction. His reaction is what made it funny. Like I knew he was from the spaz, but I didn't know what he was gonna do. My nigga breaking tables and shit. Get the fuck out of here, you fucking bitch! Get out! Get out of this house! Me personally, I wouldn't take this level of disrespect. Somebody needs to put the mother in her place, bro. Like I'm, I'm just sick of it, bro. I'm sick of the disrespect, bro. I'm sick of the disrespect. At this point, somebody need to put the mom in her place, bro. Cause she, she, she pissing me off at this point, bro. I need Kelly. I need, I need. Cause look, if the son not gonna step up, I need Kelly to step the fuck up. And I, and I need her to step up to this nigga too. That shit looks so beautiful. Just imagine if uh, Zaire shows up out of nowhere. I'm like, bro, how the fuck you knew she was like she was leaving the way she was gonna be at? Wait a minute. Excuse me. Yes, ma'am. Heidi. Uh, Ow. Oh Heidi. shit! Wait, 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 wait. Oh no. Wait. If oh so oh, it's all finna come together now. It's all finna come together now, bro. I wouldn't have said nothing because now she about to run. You're a smart motherfucker. That's right. Oh, it's it's all finna come together now. It's all finna start coming together. I'm I'm so scared, but I'm so hyped. Why are you running from me? I am not who you think I, I know am. it's you, and you're coming to the police with no. me. No, no. Ah! I ain't gonna lie. She was quick with it. She was quick oh with that. God. She took your, that's the worst part. She took your phone too, nigga. Oh, it's me. I had to get another phone. You okay? Uh, uh, is Ray around? Can you put him on the phone? Yeah, but he doesn't want to speak to you. I don't give a fuck. Please put him on put the phone. On or put it on speakerphone, whatever. Like. Yeah, Zaire is innocent. I just saw the woman that he supposedly killed. Where are you? I'm in the DR. Santa Domingo. Let me get one of my investigators out there. No, she'll be gone by then. Cal's here. Mia, he's been worried sick. Nah. No, Ray, I, your mother doesn't want me there. Look, I'll talk to her. Cap. <laughs> Let me get my guy on the plane right now. Just come to the house. Okay. She had to come back to the crib. She was so quick with it, though. Like, she pulled that spray bottle, snap, snap, took her phone and dipped, nigga. Like, that was, she was too quick with it, bro. Right, I get it! I just, I, bro, I thought she was finna catch her ass, bro. I'm so mad right now. At this point, Kelly got to stand up to the mom, bro. I'm sorry, bro. Did you reach your investigator? Landon, as we speak. Okay. Nah, something feels off. I'm sorry. I have to take this. Yeah, go on. Something just feels off, bro. The whole vibe hey, is just hey, off. You I need you to trust me here, all right? I want you to check your email. You're kidding. I know it's illegal, okay, but I have to make it up to you somehow. What is it? Hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. Can somebody please tell me what the fuck is going on? Wait. This chemo, it just makes me so sick. Oh. Oh she did that on purpose, oh, bro. She did that on purpose, bro. Everything okay? Yeah. Kelly, yeah. Kelly, Kelly, Maybe. Kelly, Kelly. No, don't drink that. Oh, you can see the little sizzle in it too. No, Kelly, you should have known by now. She, dr nah, bro. Oh no, you did that, bro. As soon as you saw what you just saw, that's when you should have picked up on. You, that's when you should have picked it up and like, nah, bro. And I'm scared because I, because her, her friend. I think her friend in, in on it too. Her friend in on it too. She gotta be. But what's the connection between them and Zaire? That's what I'm trying to figure out. What's the connection? Thank you. Don't drink that. Don't drink that. You enjoy your drink. No, don't drink that. You help me get this meal ready? Oh, yeah. Uh, you can wash those. Oh, you won't be needing that. Nah, see, come on. I'll come cut on. them. Nah, come on, Kelly. Come on, be smart, be smart. You haven't touched your drink. What did your clerk say? I think our investigator found her. Cap. We'll see about getting that man out of jail. Why can't we just hit the judge tonight? 
No, come on, man. This is no, bro. Yeah, read your email. Read it. Who got you this, Jimmy? Your PI? You mean, mom? You don't have cancer? No, what? son. What the fuck? Cooked all of this shit up. For what? I want sympathy for my votes. Really, nigga? Does Cal know about this? It would break his heart. So where's so where <laughs> is he right Charlize, now? Charlie's, who decided to sleep with a penniless, desperate artist. Ray, I. Oh, shut the fuck up. <laughs> my boys are so good, and you two cheat with the same fucking guy. I don't believe this. Wouldn't let that shit happen to me, though. Charlie's, get the kids. Let's get out of here, okay? Girl, let's go. Stab her. No, I won't. I won't. Well, they, well, they gonna kill you, yeah. shit. Y'all stupid. Hold up. Here's how stupid they are, because they really think for a second, bro, she probably gonna stab your dumb ass. Why would you freely, willingly give her the knife to say stab her? What makes you think she's not gonna stab your stupid ass, nigga? The f Come on, bro. She gonna stab her in the throat or something. Damn, I knew it. I got yeah, yeah, kill this bitch, bro. Where the fuck is Kyle, bro? It's, it, see, it, it, it. Kelly, really? Exactly. Keep hitting that nigga, exactly. What the fuck wrong with you? Thank you. I would have kept hitting that nigga. Honey, what are you doing? Thank you. Get his keys. Get his keys. Get his keys. Run. Bitch. Well, she's out of here. She ain't even try. She ain't even try. I would have got the gun too. What the fuck? Bro. Damn. Nah, Kyle got to show up now, bro. You mean to tell me you got in the car and didn't lock the door? Is that what you're telling me? <laughs> Fuck ya! Ooh! Whoa. You know what I would have done? I would have hit the brakes, watch her ass fly off, and then I would have, you know what I'm saying? I would have pumbled her shit. I swear to God, if this nigga is in on it, God forgive me, but I swear if he's in on it, bro. I swear, he, I'm, if, he's he's in, if he's if he's in on it, bro. Ray is in on it. Wait, what? Please, Charlize, Charlize, we're sitting right. Baby, please, I need you. Baby, look. Breathe, breathe. I need you to breathe. I'ma just assume he's in on it. Can you just send somebody at 345 on Highway 57? Yeah, yeah, send somebody. I would have told him turn back yeah. around, nigga. They tried to kill me. Mia, come on. Yeah, nine one one. Yeah. Hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. Now nah, he in on it. She figured it all out. Yeah. I need you. Exactly. I, oh, bro. Oh. I'm finna say, hit that Bluetooth, nigga. I'm gonna assume he's in on it. Cause why, cause why wouldn't he be? You know, my mom told me you would do this. I had no idea you fought for him like Charlize did. But my mom was so right. This shit would never work with you. Bro, I'm just so mad. I'm, why? um, yeah, why? That's why I was with him. You're so weak, nigga. A man with money and mm. success. Mm. I still. He is nothing. If you only knew. <laughs> gonna say he more of a man than you. Ooh, that's all right. She, she gonna get, she, she gonna get her lick back. I ain't worried about that. What are you doing? Get up. Nah, if he get up from that, there's no way. That nigga flew out the windshield, oh nigga. Are you, ma'am, are you okay? Woo, you know he did. Raymond Harper has been arrested for covering up evidence in a crime, along with a number of other charges. We are also being told that this is all in connection with the Zaire Mallory case. Now, now imagine now, him being a black man realizing all the shit that they said about him wasn't true. Are you angry at the prosecution? I'm angry at any system that can allow this to happen. 
Who would you like to thank the most for this? Mia. Mia Harper. I appreciate you, Mia. Damn. No, Kelly and the mama should have threw hands, bro. She just really why not oh my god bro dog i ain't gonna lie i'm i'm not gonna lie to you. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get straight to it i knew the black chick uh Ch charlise i knew she was gonna die this bitch talking about some you get the keys and let's go and then like the fucking the gun was on the ground bro i would have picked up the gun and, and shot all these niggas bro Charlize probably would have caught one too just because she was working with him and I couldn't trust you after that. So Charlize is debatable, but at the same time, I feel like she could have got one too. Cal, Cal definitely should, should, would have got one. He would have got, the mom would have got multiple. Cause bro, the mom was, bro, the mom was disrespecting Kelly every chance she got, bro. And I'm like, dude, nah, bro. Kelly got a, they, Kelly got a, stab the fuck out this woman, bro. Like something, kill this bitch, bro. Every chance she got, she was, she was, Kelly was just catching strays, bro. I'm like, dude, this is, bro, this is some bullshit, bro. Like, Kelly catching strays for what? Like, for nothing. And bro, she, bro, she started disrespecting her at the very start of the movie. The very start of the movie, she was being disrespectful, bro. Like, I hate the fact that, like, Kelly didn't want to be with, uh, Zaire no more. Like, you know what I'm saying? She didn't want to be with him no more. He was like, please, please allow me to see you. She was like, threw that phone in the trash and kept it pushing. I'm like, man, that's tough. Like, I guess to her knowledge, she kind of like, you the reason why I, why I was in the situation I was in. And, and they stated they didn't want her to, like, represent him. They didn't want her to represent Zaire. But it's like, I mean, like, you can't stop her from doing that, number one. It's like, number two, if y'all was really, if it, if, it, if, it, it was, if it was really that, like, serious. I mean, I can see why they, I can see why they were trying to put him in jail. I ain't gonna lie, Cal, I knew he won shit. Since, like, in the first 15 minutes, I knew he won shit. Because he was, he was allowing the mom, again, to this. He, he was allowing so much to happen. Like with the mom again disrespecting Kelly, he was allowing that shit to happen every chance. Like, bro, like you a man, nigga, stand up, nigga. I, and I, I knew, I knew Ray was a crazy nigga. I knew all of them was crazy, honestly. All in all, man, this was a crazy movie, bro. Crazy movie. I give it a first watch. I give it a solid. I want a solid like eight out of ten. Solid eight out of ten. I just wish the ending would have been more. I would, I, I kind of wish that she would have gave me like Jennifer Lopez enough type of uh. I mean, she, I mean, well, hell, she ran over one. Got another one, like shit, flown up the fucking car. But Ray, Ray was able to walk off. He, he didn't get away, but he was able to walk that shit off. I still would have shot, but still, bro, the, the gun was on the ground. Bro, I would have shot, bro. As soon as that gun fell out that nigga hand, bro, I would have shot that nigga. All in all, this was a good movie, 8 out of 10, solid 8 out of 10. Kelly Rowland was so beautiful the whole movie, man. I re Again, I wish he would have... Her and bro would have ended up together, but it is what it is. But if you did like this reaction, man, make sure you leave a like. Comment down below what you want to see next. Share the video. Subscribe if you want to see more of me. Hit that Patreon link below to see the full video, man. Till next time. Stay lit.